A pleasant greetings to all. In this video, I am going to explain how to find the equivalent resistance using MATLAB simile. Consider the problem. Find the equivalent resistance between A and B. Here in this problem, I am going to use the simile to find out the answer. What are the components needed? First one, power guy. Second, resistor. Third, voltage source. Fourth, current measurement block. Fifth, display. Seven, voltage measurement block. And last one is divider block. Next, I am going to explain what are the steps needed to perform this in simile. First, open the MATLAB. Second, click on the Simulink library. Third, open new window in the Simulink. Fourth, add the component. Fifth one, run. Okay, first I am going to open the MATLAB. So in a MATLAB, I am going to open the Simulink library. Then file, go to the new, then open the model. Now what I have to do, first of all, the power guy, so I have to add the power guy. The next one is measurement. So two measurement block I am going to add here. One is current measurement and another one is voltage measurement. And next one is RLC. RLC. That's a series branch here. First of all, I am going to open this and put R. Then apply, then OK. Here I am going to increase the size here. Okay, next. Okay, I am going to increase the size. Then current measurement block, I have set the voltage measurement here. Then series RLC. And I have to change the name here. So the name is R1. That's 4 R1 is needed. 1, 2, then 3, then 4. Okay, again, I need the vertical one. So, clockwise direction. I have to copy the similar one. Then paste it. Then I am going to copy this. And I am going to paste this. Then divider block. So divide here and then display also. Okay, have to add the display here. Then voltage source. So DC voltage I needed I to take the DC voltage source then I have to change the value here 100 volt normal DC voltage source may be a 100 volt one so no, no need to change this next I am going to change the resistance value first the resistance is 2 ohm Okay, then apply, then OK, then 4 ohm, apply, then OK, and again 2 ohm, apply, then OK, here 8 ohm, apply, then OK, and next I am going to change this value.
okay the value is value of the resistance is 4 this one is 4 4 ohm apply then okay here 8 ohm apply then okay and next this resistance is again 4 ohm apply then okay okay next for a current measurement here have to flip this block in order to connect it properly so flip the block here and then here have to rotate this in a counterclockwise direction then only the connection becomes easy and next this current measurement I have to copy this one and I have to change the name CM and for the voltage measurement also I have to change the name so that is VM so VM that's all next I am going to connect all the blocks so first all the resistances should be connected together so in this I have to connect all the resistances here and then these resistances are connected and this one is connected here this is connected in this point and this one is connected in this point see this is the 100 voltage source and current measurement here this portion is connected and this one is connected to divider one and here voltage measurement block you have to connect like this and the output of this is connected to multiplication then what I have to do I have to click the run button okay now I get the answer 8 8 is the correct answer thank you have a nice day